Welcome back. Can you believe it? Today is the final day of 2020. Woo! Mm -hmm. No, Highmark First Night will not have the in-person events downtown like other New Year's Eves, but there will be plenty of art, music, and more. And just like last year, David and Heather will host, and they will make sure to ring in 2021 with style. You can watch it starting at 11 o'clock tonight, right here on KDKA. I'm excited to watch Me those two tonight. Too. And the countdown is on with only 13 and a half hours to go until our first night broadcast and 14 and a half hours <laughs> left until the calendar changes over to 2021. You have all the math down. <laughs> I Preparations do, I do. for first night last all year and this morning the work continues to make sure everything is ready to go. Joining us live from the roof of the Highmark building downtown is first night director Sarah Aziz. Sarah, what's going on right? What's going on there right now? I see the ball in the background. <laughs> Yeah, the ball is here. Good morning, ladies. Thanks for thanks for having me. I can't believe neither of you. You guys have both been up here with me before in the past, but you're all warm and cozy in your studio <laughs> this morning. I know, Sarah, you look nice and bundled up up there on the roof. The ball looks beautiful behind oh, you. I know it. And so you're you're in last minute yeah. preparations for tonight. What's what's going on? Um, you know, we're we're just ready to uh, count down. We're we're ready to get get on TV at 11 with uh, David and Heather and and ring in 2021 and say goodbye to 2020. Oh, we are ready. I know. I don't know about you, Mikey. I'm I know, ready. Right. I'm Usually <laughs> we're we're hustling. We're shutting down streets and you know none of that this year. Yeah. yeah everyone so, can stay cozy on their couches. <laughs> That's exciting. <laughs> so is. what can people expect for tonight? They can expect a really fun hour. We've kind of condensed um, our typical Highmark First Night Pittsburgh Festival into an hour. So you'll still get music and magic and dance and all of those things that you love that you come to expect from from Highmark First Night Pittsburgh just in your living room on your TV with with David and Heather also in the studio, not on a snowy couch like last <laughs> yeah, year. Yeah. And they will be, I know, so fancy and decked out tonight. Oh, I can't wait to I see what they're wearing there. I know I had a lot of people asking me, Sarah, why does the ball rise in Pittsburgh Ooh, versus it's getting tested. Look, it's, it's going up. It's testing now. Is it is it going up? Yes. now? Yes. Yeah. So the so the ball rises here in Pittsburgh. It, the ball is named the future of Pittsburgh ball and it rises because Pittsburgh is a city on the rise. So it's just a nice way to ring in the new year with something something going up rather than something coming down. I love that. I think that's just a great yeah. way to ring in the new year. Well, Sarah, what else do you want people to look forward to tonight? What else can we expect from this celebration? Yeah, of course. So, you know, it, I think it's just going to be we're going to have fireworks. We're going to have Frizzy. You guys know and love Frizzy. Oh, yeah. um, he's going to ring in the new year and um, perform right under the ball behind us. And um, lots of local Pittsburgh groups will be featured tonight. So we just hope everyone tunes in, has a good time. Maybe you'll get dressed up for your living room or maybe you'll be in your jammies. Whatever is uh, whatever is <laughs> comfy, you can you can choose. Yeah, I tell you, boy, if you live downtown to be able to see like the ball rise, that's so cool. Or maybe even Mount Washington is a good place to watch the ball from your home. I, mean, I guess maybe if you live from there. your window, mm -hmm. if you happen, if you happen to live there. But we're definitely encouraging everyone to stay home. Um, the really, really, I promise you the best shots are going to be on KDKA. We, your crew is incredible and you're you're not going to get a better view than you will from your TV tuned into KDKA or from your computer streaming it. Um, on the CBSN. Oh yeah, I, I have a question. I hate to even ask it, but I'm so curious. <laughs> have you? I mean, the ball oh, looks. No, oh okay. no! Oh, we're not even going to say it, Sarah. The ball <laughs> is looking good, and it's it's going to be good tonight. <laughs> it is. All right, we're excited. Well, thank it you. It is. Thank you so much, Sarah. Thanks for having me. And Selena, will you tell your dad Happy New Year? He's a staple oh, and we miss him. And oh. please wish him a Happy New Year. I'll tell him. He will be watching. I know he, he's a part of it every night downtown, but he's excited to have a relaxing night and watch David and Heather maybe get some Chinese. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much, Sarah. Um, it's really good seeing you and for taking the time out to be with us. I know she has a, a very, very busy schedule. Oh, yes. yeah. Lots of last minute preparation. So we can't wait to bring in the new year with her. I know it's going to be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for the show. <laughs> and folks, we know we mentioned it before, but just in case you were just tuning us on right now, turning us on right now, rather, Heather and David will welcome 
welcome in the new year with you tonight. So make sure to tune in starting at 11 p.m. Join us for first night festivities and they really do have a lot of great performers they coming sure up. Do. OK, enough about tonight. What's next with Mikey and I here on PTL? <laughs> the answer, we got a lot going on. Fireworks displays are a New Year's tradition for many cities across the U.S. But what about the rest of the world? Dr. Lori has the answer. Yeah, plus some Americans are already starting to see the $600 stimulus checks show up in their checking accounts. How do we manage that money effectively? An expert shares some advice for people on both sides of the financial spectrum. And what does Mother Nature have planned for New Year's Eve tonight and the rest of the holiday weekend? Meteorologist Ron Smiley has that forecast coming up on PTL.